it is the world's most valuable car maker. More valuable than the next top six companies combined. But it may have failed in enforcing some important values at its workplace. Like respecting women. Tesla has been accused of rampant sexual harassment by a woman employee. Her name is Jessica Barraza, a 38-year-old production associate who worked at a Tesla factory in Fremont, California. Last week, Barraza filed a lawsuit claiming that she was subjected to constant harassment, like at calling and inappropriate physical touching by her employees. Barraza has claimed that nearly every day for three years, my female co-workers and I were objectified, threatened, touched and propositioned on the factory floor. I felt degraded, humiliated and traumatized. The lawsuit further alleges that supervisors and managers at the Fremont factory were not just aware of such pervasive harassment, but also participated in abusive behavior. Did the company know about this? The lawsuit claims that the victim filed several internal complaints. But Tesla's human resource department did nothing to address them. Instead, it disabled an email address meant for filing such complaints. The allegations are shocking, but they're hardly surprising. Tesla has a history of covering up workplace harassment, especially at its factory in Fremont a factory that has been identified as a predator zone in several lawsuits. In February 2017, another woman employee had sued Tesla for pervasive harassment at the Fremont plant. How did the company respond? By firing her for what it said were false accusations. Then in October 2017, a black employee at the Fremont plant had accused his supervisors of racial harassment. For once, the charges were upheld. Tesla was ordered to pay $137 million in damages. Now, another employee at the same factory has raised allegations of inappropriate behavior. Something that she says flows from the top. Right from the CEO, Elon Musk. Yes, the victim has claimed that Musk does not set a good example for his employees through his sexually suggestive tweets. She has cited a recent one to make her point. This tweet from October 21st, where Musk joked about starting a new university dubbed the Texas Institute of Technology and Science. A name which many deduced as a crude acronym for a female body part. The victim claims that such irresponsible tweets from the boss are fueling a culture of misogyny and objectification of women employees at the workplace. Tesla abolished its public relations department last year and is yet to respond to the allegations. Bureau Report, Vion, World is One.